Alrighty, everyone. Heading into our second half of tonight. I think what we're going to do is head further west. These are tougher enemies here. And this is where we're going to have our second fight against... Or our third fight against Azakura. And I've been told it's going to be pretty tough. But I think we're equipped. Like, he's level 28. And they said Azakura will be like 35 or something like that. I think we'll be able to beat him. I'm feeling like we're good enough now. So, continue on that way. I don't know what that is. Okonomiyaki? What is Okonomiyaki, Dark Gaming? I'm not aware of that. <laughs> Damn, she hit him into the car. He bounced off the car into the other guy. Ouch. Double kill? No. Killed the weaker guy. A baddie ballerino. Look at this. Whoa. Damn, they're getting rocked in the traffic. Oh, oh. Oh, so much good wage tippy. A Japanese teppanyaki savory pancake fish? Oh, I've never had anything like that before. Pancake fish style. Yeah, it could be pretty good. I think that could be pretty good, right? Hmm. Uh-oh. We gotta rescue somebody. Alright, assholes. Time to get beat up. Threatening man. Oh, they're weak. Boom! Look at that combo! They do a two a, a combo together. That's sweet, actually. Let's get it done. Finish him, Tommy. Yeah. Easy peasy. An iron jump. Alright, keep heading this way. I could take on anything. Hey, what's scary? Enjoying the show. The battle's on. Ruffians. Cool. Oh. Oh! Combo! Love the combo. You're in it now. Bonk! Damn, he flew into the car. Follow my lead. Damn, shot him up. Alright. Oh come on, hit the other guy who's right there. Okay, I'm up. To the ink block. That's kicking time. No follow up. How about this for a follow up? Shoot him right in the middle of the street with cars driving by. All right. Very good. Muscle soda. Very good. Is it coming? Yeah, it's around the corner, so probably save a few times. Here we go. What are you looking at? fight. Team of ruffians. Oh, these are level 25. These are tougher. I killed three of them. Wow. Very good. Follow my lead. We're stuck. He's stuck. He's glitched. So they do a combo attacks now. That's neat. They do double team attacks. Very cool. Level up. Kazuga. Hmm? So, we're approaching. He's going to be over here. Is that him? I think that's him. All right, we're going to do it. Let's save one more time. This could be tough, but I think we're going to pull it off, considering the fact that uh, we're pretty high level. We're like level 29 now. I think we'll solo him. I think we can do it. Hey. 
How's Akura? How's it hanging? Ichiban Kasuga, you actually showed up. Why wouldn't he show up? <laughs> He's already kicked your butt twice. Yup. You know, something seems different about you, somehow. Glad that you noticed. See, after our last bout, I made a complete 180. I realized I needed to perfect myself as a fighter. I saw that even though I had talent, I wasn't letting it grow. All I was doing was flexing. But that's all over and done with. <laughs> that's right. As to how much I've improved, well, you'll just have to see for yourself, won't you? So, we doing this or what? Let's do it. <clears throat> Let's see how this goes. What level is he? This should be fun. Let's do it. Cool. Only 26? Oh, this is going to be piss easy. Open one. Do this. Oh. Show me what you got. That's kicking time. Keep doing it. Open one. Do this. Oh, triple quarterback sack. Let's get it done. Do this. Missed. That's kicking time. Missed again. Let's get it done. Break yourself. Oh, almost done. And he's bleeding now. I blocked too early. That's kicking time. Come on, bleed. Done. We got him. Beautiful. It was a pretty, pretty fair fight. All right. Damn, 10,000 experience for that fight. <laughs> Rank up. I learned Hail Mary Bomb and has a fire element. The first move that he has is a linebacker that even has an element, right? Everything else has been like standard damage, so that's cool. <clears throat> Ooh, I'd say uh, you've improved plenty. The new used toughest nails. Still not enough to take you down. Don't know how you got better every time. I can tell you've been training your ass off, though. Yeah. Wasn't until our last fight that it hit me. I was only polishing my image, not my skill. That had to change. Before, I was only beating down weaklings. That kind of thing gets old. Just one meaningless smackdown after another. But when you and I fought, I felt something I hadn't felt in forever. I was energized. And I remembered why I started fighting in the first place. To feel a lot. <laughs> hey, you really made a 180. Good for you, man. Hey, you think my viewers will notice the difference too? Mm -hmm. What, you're still making videos? Oh, hell yeah. Take our previous match, for instance. It's my most popular video yet. Huh? You were filming that? <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't tell you. Haha, <laughs> my bad. Well, don't trip, but I made sure that your face was blurred out. Privacy rights and all that. <sighs> That's bullshit, actually. It's not true at all. As long as you're filming in a public place, there's no privacy rights in the United States. You could have filmed wherever you wanted, as long as it's public. Uh, you have the right to film. Like, I still had any privacy on the internet. Well, whatever. What are people saying about our fight? I think my fans are enjoying it. I had to pull out all the stops only to lose, but I think it's that's exactly what made it such a thrill. And it turns out people like the serious competition way better. They feel more from it like I did. So don't go thinking this is over. I still got training to do, techniques to master. And then we'll have us a finale. So there's one more coming up. Once I beat you in front of millions of viewers, it'll be the ultimate comeback. A fitting end to an epic saga, wouldn't you say? <laughs> you got it all planned out, huh? Well, I hope you don't mind if I put my own spin on it. <laughs> Ta, I welcome you to try. Huh? Okay. All right, then. Who's that? Found you at last, Asakura. Who is this? Someone's stalking the guy? Hmm. Learned Heart of a Champion? Another new ability. I learned another new ability. Uh, so we had already known... What was the last one we had learned? Was it Tenacious Fist? I can't remember what the last one was. I think it might have been Merciless Melee. Now we have Heart of a Champion. Boost your attack and defense as you get into the zone. Oh! It's a good self-buff. 
Cool. Geek Generalist says in Japan they have privacy rights even if he's not in Japan anymore. Well, it depends. Like, for example, let's say, for example, he's uploading to YouTube. When you upload to YouTube, you have to abide by the laws of YouTube in California because that's where YouTube is incorporated. Okay? Now, there's been issues with certain companies thinking that they're above the law and then they take matters into their own hands. In reality, if it ever were to go to court, they would lose, but no one's going to sue over YouTube and that's why, uh, basically... Uh, most people just abide by whatever the rules are here in the United States, but there have been issues with, like, for example, Japanese companies going after people, and they're like, but I don't understand. I'm abiding by fair loose law in the United States, but no one wants to get into giant legal battles over it. But if he films in the States and he uploads to YouTube, which is in the States, it's all allowed. It's all fine. As long as it's a public place, then it's allowed. If it was filmed on private property without explicit permission, that would not be allowed, actually. Oh, uh, let's see here. I have zero MP right now. Do I have an MP recovery item? I have a bunch. Or do I want to do a combo item, maybe? Like a mango pudding. Ready? It works. Yeah, because I want to fight that mini boss over there that's hiding there. Okay, I want to fight this mini boss. So let's quickly save. Let's fight the mini boss. Okay. Oh man, it's the Master Keg Man. Look at this guy. <clears throat> Anyone weak to this? No, he's resistant. Re okay, weak to fire. Beautiful. I missed the button input, damn it. Cool. Okay, here's a new one Hail Mary Bomb. Whoa, it says you launch a bar ball sky high, it comes down next turn. Let's try that. That's interesting. You're in it now. Hey, you good? Okay. Double dragon. Oh yeah. All right. Looks like I'm up. Here we go, burning arrow. Oh. Uh oh. Damn, knock us all on our asses. We're all burned. Yeah, all three of us got burned. How do you like that? Here comes the football. It should be coming down. Here it comes. They killed him. <laughs> they murdered his ass. That's actually pretty powerful at the expense of the turn. I got a Kiwami mouth guard. I wonder what that's for. Kiwami mouth guard. Learning more every day. Who do I? All right, make you leveling up and Tomi leveling up. Oh, we can recruit this guy. Let's do it. Hell yeah. Kiwami mouth guard. What's that for? A tank commander. Let's use the master set. There we go. Take this. A peace offering. And then we gotta mash the button, right? What's Pull button so X. Like? No, A. Oh. oh my god, huh? Sure, I'll pal around. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's a two star. A two star guy. Two star Sujiman. Cool. Jasper's great today. He's relaxing downstairs with Cat, of course. I could take on anything. There we go. Yo, should I open it? A gold chest, and inside Sweet. we have a gas mask. Is it an accessory? It is an accessory. Nullifies poison. Nullifies fear. Oh, where did we get this black belt? Increase HP by ten, MP by five, and all the stats by a ton. All right, I'll give him that. That's, like, really good. So she has the gorgeous gloves. And then... What's the other thing she has equipped? A fairy lay. Oh, increased items obtained in battle. We want that. Forget the value pack insole. These suck. Let's give him something better. What does he have? Uh, nullifies bleed. Completely nullifies bleed. Oh. 
Kiwami Mouth Guard decrease the MP cost of all skills? Oh! I wonder how much. I wonder by how much that does, because that sounds great, right? Man, I'm going to give... Maybe I'll give him the Kiwami Mouth Guard. Or maybe I'll give it to Tomi. I mean, they're both good. <clears throat> Do that. And the Lucky Money Charm, and then he has Metal Brooch, and... All right, we'll keep these. All right, cool. Having children's in theaters. Now, I heard that it's it's a limited run in certain theaters. I don't think it's around out here. I could be wrong. I didn't look, but I don't think it's... It's not, like, nationwide release. It's just a special hey, thing there. to celebrate the release this of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth Tell next week. Okay, I'm up. Let's go. Here we go. Nice hit, all three of them. I'm not gonna do the Hail Mary bomb. I'm just gonna beat these guys up normally, I think. Nice. End of auto follow up on top of it. No, we're done with Bundoko Island. There's no point to doing it again. It's just money, and you unlock this super attack, but I don't need the super attack nor the money. I'm, I'm gonna get more than enough money. Oh, another new ability, Iron Matriarch. I'm gonna get more than enough money by doing things like the challenge dungeons and stuff, so I'm not gonna do Should that I anymore. It? <clears throat> Got it. Four star protective wear. Wow, I'm finding a lot of good stuff, right? Four star gear. Hell yeah. Nullify poison, cold, and burn? That's great. So let's give her the Madam Fur then. And then give him the running clothes. Okay. We're getting finding some great stuff, man. All right, let's continue on out of here. Let's fight our way out, all right? I can do this. So our new one's called Iron Matriarch. Dual wield appliances like a domestic goddess, causing magic damage to enemies within a small chance of burning them. They're all weak to this, so let's try it. Holy shit! Holy shit! Well, that was outstanding. Killed every person. All right, here's a new one. Holy wait, 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 shit! Wait, wait, yeah, I like. I definitely like the Shitose's house uh, house cleaner job because she has all the elements. She has fire and water oh. elements, which are both really good right now. So that's why I like it. The thing is, she has other jobs she could be doing, but it, we only have one female who can do those jobs. I think Just later on there's going to be work. multiple females, so each one can have a different job. Achievement! Sujimon Snagum. Recruited 10 Sujimon from battle. All right. <clears throat> Nicely done. So, where do we want to go next? We haven't been all the way down here. Let's walk down here. Maybe in these corridors there's some more stuff. And then we go to the end of the street. Outside of that, there's a Tomi conversation here that we can do. Um, there's actually a conversation here. If we head further north, we haven't even been back here yet. There could be missions and stuff back there. I don't know. We do have a mission out here. Grise and Grind. Oh, this was the comedian turned into barista. Correct? We could do that. So let's just investigate the rest of this area first. And then we'll continue on. To other areas to see what's there, but I want to obviously I want to do all the fights. What I want to see what's at? around here. Hopefully, Run some good items. The is on. Time to go all out. Almost dead from one hit, and never mind, dead from one hit. <clears throat> Have a barrel. <clears throat> Damn. Boom. Boom. Hey, you always gotta love people who come to a stream again. to complain about the game being played when they outright knew what the stream was going to be. Right? Oh, this game's a snoozer. Then why are you here? Come back when I'm not playing a game that you find boring. I play a ton of different games. By the way, Cyclone of Iido. A new skill for Tomi. <clears throat> Man, I really hate fried chicken, but I just hang out at Popeyes and KFC all the time to tell them how much I don't like fried chicken. <laughs> oh, that means you're a genius. You really pissing me off. Right. Time to throw down. Okay, I'm up. Cool. 
I won't hold that. Murdered. Looks like I'm up. Flash him up. There's an insane amount of content in this game. We're only in chapter six, and I'm twenty, like over twenty-five hours in. So this game's gonna be so long, man. All right, it's a boss. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want to trigger the boss yet. Uh, are we all right? I think maybe Shitose needs some MP recovery. Outside of that, I think we're all right. But let's get some MP recovery for her. Yeah. Okay. Not bad. <laughs> Yummy. Yummy. All right, we'll do that. That's good. Oh uh, no, I forgot to turn the sign on. Right? I, I keep forgetting to turn it on on late streams. All right, here we go, mini boss. Really pissing me off. Ready to run. Island Bruiser. Oh, this guy's back. Yeah. Captain Cruncher from the first game returned. Something wrong. All right, let's do it. Let's do the Hail Mary bomb. We'll come down next turn and kick their asses. Time to go all out. Iron Matriarch time. Oh yes! Look at that. Crazy good attack. I won't hold that. He's resistant to it. So let's do firing squad. Shoot them both in a line here, right? Here we Nothing go. Jade loves it. I'm glad that you love it, Jade. I'm really enjoying the game as well. Looks like I'm up. Run on home tomorrow. Here's a new one. Cyclone of Yaido. Di damage a wave of enemies could inflict bleed. Alright, probably not worth it. Because it's, it's a wave of enemies and there's not a wave of enemies. So we'll just do this. I missed the first hit. That sucked. Damn, nice follow up. Ow. Couldn't even see. Here comes the. the uh... Nice. Lays right on his head. That wasn't bad at all. And I'll just do a quarterback sack. I missed it. Damn it, I keep missing that button input. It's like a delayed button input. I can do that. He's not weak to any element. No. Prepare yourself. No stain, no I missed it again. Fuck. Scrub it off his skin. Damn, she scrubbed his skin off his body and murdered him. Damn. Oh, good amount of experience. We got metal shin guards, another good defensive item, it looks like. Hey, and we can recruit seeing? the Captain Cruncher. Nice. Let's do it. There you go. Token Here we go. How about it? Huh. What's it so like? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> sure, I'll pal around. You did it. Sujiman snagged, baby. All right. Thank you, No Sweet Bro. I hope you have a nice, relaxing, productive day off tomorrow. And Derek says, I believe the combat's better. They added the green area arrows for combat attacks. Yeah, there's all directional attacks now and positioning. And it's really it's really improved from the first game. Sid says, did you hear Harada wants to promo ban Rage Quitters in Tekken? That'd be awesome. First time they would ever do that in a video game. Sweet. Insulated innerwear. Wow, we're getting tons of good gear here. So first of all, he already has metal shin guards. How much, what level is the insulated wear? Oh, it's not here. Is it? What is the insulated wear? Oh, nullified paralysis. Okay. So. She already has level 3 Madam Footwear, so we should give it to one of them. Let's give it to him, maybe. Metal Shin Guards. Cool. Alright. Another enemy group of enemies over there. Hey, you! Bring it on. The Master Set is like the Master Ball in Pokemon. Instant win, no mash required. The Master Set? What do you mean by that? Master set of what? I'm confused. It's you and me. Combo! Ha <laughs> Three! Triple combo. That's so good. Okay, I'm up. Weak to it. Yay. Oh, 
follow my lead. How, how long till I think it's safe to stream Persona 3? I have no idea. I'm not playing it anytime soon regardless. I've got too many RPGs going on, as you know. Maybe later this year, we'll see, but I'm not, not in too much of a rush. Oh, here we go. A squirmy worm. Recruit that squirmy worm. Oh, shit. Oh, this is what I'm giving to him right now. Oh, so this is like the master ball, the master set. And I got those from buying the best version of the game. So they gave you the master items with the two Cool. Okay. So we'll pretty much all, always join. That's cool. The squirmy worm. All right. There's another chest. Should I open it? Got it. A mood booster. Nothing too special there. Can I go this way? No. I guess we got to go around from the street to get to the other side of this. <laughs> Found ya. What you looking at? Go Run to the street over here. Show me what you got. Almost a double kill, and ooh, very nice. You may not even need to tap rapidly because it might already be maxed out. Maybe I'll try that next time. I won't do it. We'll see what happens. I won't tap at all. <clears throat> Here we go. It's an item. Best fortune. Rubbish collector. Sujimon stuff. I don't really care about that. I'll take the item, though. I want to take you home, CD. CD stacker. Hmm? All right. So, we have not been to this central area. Let's do that and see what's there. Because it looks like there's a conversation and maybe some other stuff. And, uh, and then we'll probably go to the other area we haven't been to yet. Well, let's take a look here. Oh, photo op. Oh, what's going on? We're getting a, a call. Asakura, he was final level. He's probably like level 35, 40, I bet. I got a good feeling about my chances. I want a final match. Come to the warehouse behind the docks. I'll be waiting. Another challenge from Asakura. I bet he's amped up for the finale. Better get ready first. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do that yet. We'll, we'll hold off on that one. That one's probably going to be pretty high level, I feel. This is the Ball well. Moderni. Or Modern. It's Buff Dude, who's already our friend. Oh, can we invite this giant roided dude to the island? Still good to go. Yes, we can invite him. Poison Mitsuo has been invited to Dondoko Island. <laughs> okay. That Dark Gaming says I think that one's level 32. Okay. <clears throat> Let's not do it yet. Maybe we'll do it later because we already did it. Aloha. Postcard assortment? What would I do? Oh, these are gifts. Here's DIY stuff from Dondoko Island. I don't want to get the gifts. Boomerang Briefs, my favorite. So, this is all new. We haven't been here yet. Let's go this way first. Oh, we've seen this from the other side. Psychedelic Coffee. This is the name of the shop. Psychedelic Coffee. Aloha. Psychedelic Cafe. Rainbow bagel. That's bizarre. Why would it be a rainbow? Whoa, HP was 250 and lowers your drunkenness. Why is it rainbow color? I've never seen that Thank before. You. Poison Mitsuo was in Kawami 1. Oh, okay. Yes, Heavy Rain is still winning the poll for Sunday for the uh, Retro React. I don't think it's going to lose at this point. It's massively in the lead. Fuck just happened? Did you hear that? <laughs> Something got destroyed. Oh, we got another mini boss over here. Man, there's a lot of mini bosses. All right, let's do a little bit of healing. Considering I just bought some items. It works. It works. Here, eat a rainbow baby. Very good. Here we go. It All right, let's save, and we'll take on another mini boss. We're kicking the shit out of these mini bosses tonight. <clears throat> 
Dark Gaming says, FYI, there's a market north of you that sells all sorts of fruit. They let you craft really good healing items. They restock every 10 minutes or so. Oh, uh, yeah, we've been to the market. I just didn't know about buying the fruit or crafting anything. But we've been to that market before. All right, let's fight the mini boss first. Then we'll do Tomazawa the artist. Oh, my God. Look at this guy. Straight out of Saw. Missed! How did that miss? Damn. That's an ass kicking move. Carnivorous Feast! Ew! Well, good thing I didn't hit him. He recovers HP for no reason. Oh, his HP will gradually recover. I see. I'll hit him with the Hail Mary Bomb. I won't hurt that. Damn, I want to shoot him in a line. Here we go. And it works! Starts bleeding, good. Good, because now I can do the, the move that, yeah, may inflict bleed. Uh, where's the one that does more damage if they're bleeding? Here you go, greatly if they're bleeding. Nice, that does a lot of damage when he's bleeding, damn. That did a crazy amount. Oh. Nice extra follow-up. Hail Mary Bomb comes down and kills him. That's it double kill to kill the other guy too. Yeah, Hail Mary Bomb is good too. Damn, there's all these good moves now. Got a nail bat, level three weapon. I wonder who that's for. Hero class, maybe? Oh, we can recruit the piggy. Just get away from me. Bone Cleaver. There we go. There you go. Token of friendship. How about it? What the? What even is this? <laughs> Looks like Piglet from Winnie the Pooh. Oh, God. From the new Winnie the Pooh movie. I didn't see it. Thankfully, I didn't see it. Okay. This is it. Nice. Now we have the conversation to have with Tony right over here. Here we go. It must feel awesome for your art to take up space on a huge wall like this. Are you any good at art, Tommy? I enjoy it, but I'm no Picasso. I dabble here and there for fun. Hey, that's a really neat hobby. In that case, I'm looking forward to the day you paint a mural of my face. <laughs> what? That old ugly mug? Yeah. If you're gonna do it, you gotta do it big. Am I right? Oh, but make sure to add a dash of extra handsomeness, okay? You kidding me? Extra handsomeness? Shameless SOP. One of these days, I'll make a gaudy Ichiban portrait. And it'll become the hip meetup spot. Duh. Sounds like a plan, you big hipster. We're really opening up. Wow. Man, we gotta get back to Revolve Bar at some point. Hey. You go for something sweet? This guy wants something. What? Sure. Give him, uh... The, what's the crappiest one? This one. Give him a tropical. Derek, have a good night. I'll see you Friday. Sounds good. Oh, he says it'll be Saturday. Okay, sounds good. Jade says, I love art. Cool. Street art's pretty nice. If it's done well, street art's pretty nice. I don't really... I'm not a fan of just, like, standard graffiti. But street art that's done well, I do like. My boyfriend's obsessed with the art around here. Is that our boyfriend? Can't go into the art gallery. No, we can buy a gift. I'll get Chateau say because she's the lowest level. Alright, I think we've we've wandered around this block now. So I think. Well, we didn't go through this alleyway. Not that I think there's anything there. Where am I right now? Right here? Oh, uh, I kinda wanna go up here. We haven't been up there yet. Here, let's do this. Yo, 
You draw some art, no sleep real vibes? Yeah, what do you draw? What kind of art? So let's go straight north all the way, and that's gonna take us to the area we haven't been to yet. See what's over there, maybe some missions, don't know. Oh. Oh. Time to go all out. Are you getting scared? Bong. I won't hold that. Nice combo. That was awesome. Looks like I'm up. And he dies from the bleeding. Cool. Go to the pawn shop up north, get a better battery for your vehicle thing. There's a different pawn shop. I didn't even know that. Well, let's go up here and see. Here's the pawn shop, right? Yeah, we haven't been up there yet. We have not been up there at all. Ooh, hold on. Hiro Nunchoku. We have been in there. We want to go back. Hiro's Nunchoku. We go back to Action Star ever. Anime, cartoon scenery, whatever comes to mind, says those who realize. Well, that's cool. Now remember, do not give dogs cookies, but all I can do is give this guy a cookie. Because <coughs> I don't have dog food. But do not give them human food under any circumstances. a bad thing to do. Hey, hey bullies. Leave this guy alone, assholes. I can use my segue more often. <clears throat> eh, I don't think this segue is even needed. Like, I really don't see the purpose of this segue in the game. Like, I get it. Like, maybe they wanted a different way to get around, but I don't think you really need it. It's like you could walk around on your feet. Damn, I wanted to push him into the other guy, but he dropped the elbow instead. All right. Get a quick elbow. Dun, 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 dun. Get out of the way, Tommy. I won't hold that. Blah blah. Done. Executed. <clears throat> exactly. If you guys think the game sucks, then leave and come back when I'm playing something else that you like. You like. Don't sit here and complain to other people who are liking the game. They don't care about your very irrelevant opinion. <laughs> wow. Flash bang. Okay, we have not been up here yet. What do we got? So here's the other uh, pawn shop. Aw, thanks. First watch. Aloha. Yeah, I sold that paper plate, baby. I thought it said I got a silver plate, but I don't see it now. Thank you for stopping by. Aloha. Let's see, a save key, modified incendiary grenade. Here it is, the Street Surfer battery pack. All right. Sports choker? What style is this for? Oh, aren't the chokers for, uh, whatchamacallit? Eris. Eris style, all right. Okay. Thank you for stopping. There we go. Energy capacity increased. A junk monitor. Who would buy... Wait a minute. Aww, who thanks. would sell a junk monitor and who would buy a junk monitor? If it's junk, it doesn't work. Why would you get it? It doesn't make any sense. A bunch of herbs. Excuse me. The enemies up here are weak as shit, though. We do have another conversation coming up. Not really used to, not really worth it to fight the people over here. Hello. Shark teeth souvenir. Ooh. 300 HP, 90 MP. I'll buy that. Oh, I need the dog food. I'll just max out all the animal foods while I'm here. Is Shitose still suspicious? Yes, we, we haven't even advanced the plot since we found out she is still suspicious. So she is still suspicious, just we haven't really done anything to change that. <clears throat> Here we go. 
Have a banana. <laughs> Jade loves to watch the Yakuza games. I'm glad. I, I love to play them. And I'm glad you guys like to watch me play them. Dark Gaming says other pawn shops have at least two more battery upgrades. Oh, so all the pawn shops have one, huh? Okay. Frank. So this is the coffee guys coming up, right? Over here. We gotta go all the way around the block, though. We have another conversation coming up. Oh, it's right here. Let's smack these guys down and do it. The Geek Generalist says sometimes there are tinkerers who buy junk to refurbish them, buying them as new and retail at retail. If you have the skills, you can make money out of them. Okay. Orange Fanta, have a good night. Ah, seriously? These street performers are next level. Gives the circus a run for its money. Burn my ass. Right? Their skills are insane. This is it. That came out well. Now we gotta do that again. I interrupted with the picture. I didn't know that was gonna happen. These street performers are next level. Gives the circus a run for its money. Right? Their skills are insane. The other day, I saw this one guy juggle five knives. Jeez. One little mistake and it's game over for you. Forever. Huh? Confidence just went up to level seven. Like Dominant. Nothing remotely close <clears throat> to this stuff. But actually, I'm pretty darn good with a yo-yo. I can a yo-yo? Who uses oh, yo-yos nice. in this day? That's harder than it looks. Yep. I can do around Japan, and if I'm really on a roll, I can even do around Europe. I don't know much about yo-yos, but those little things can really Nice, you're gonna revive them. item randomly. Oh, yeah. Now that I think about it, <clears throat> there's even a trick called Lunar Lander. Dang. He even goes all the way to space. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. All right. Good night, Kathleen. We still got about 20 minutes left on the stream, so we're going to continue to, you know, wander around and do some stuff. And if we run into any missions, we'll do them. Want some bird food, of course. There you go. Mr. P. The bird's name is Mr. P. A wooden board? I certainly don't need that. Hero Nunchaku? I certainly don't need that. <laughs> <clears throat> Hero Sword, I most certainly don't need that. I don't know what these tickets are for. Maybe you summon right, Sujimon with them or something? I don't know. I've never, I don't, never did anything with them. So now we're actually coming up behind the orphanage. Coffee? What's this? It says there's a mission here, but I can't read it. Look. Why is it, uh... Why is it grayed out? <clears throat> More bird food? Kinta. Okay. <laughs> it's... The ukulele guy? It's the ukulele guy. Hmm. Isn't that the rival? Oh, no, it's not. It's the rival of the director. This is the director guy who wanted to beat up the otaku guy. Okay. His name is James. He was insulting Japanese cinema and bullying Nathan, so he ended up in a brawl. Hmm? What's he doing? He looks down. I thought that he was a big-time filmmaker. It'll come out fine if we shoot it that way, but... All right. Fake, fake... Christopher Nolan. Yo. You're Nathan's old classmate, right, James? He's James Cameron Christopher Nolan. James Nolan. <laughs> huh? Huh? Oh, you. You're still kicking around, huh? Actually, you caught me thinking over my new flick. Have to admit, seeing Piss Pants Nathan man up to defend those old Japanese movies finally made me curious. Oh. Oh, yeah? So you watch one? These guys were making cinema with barely any budget or effects somehow. It was powerful. The action scenes used real explosives, and the performances were so raw and authentic, I, I couldn't take my eyes away. I can't believe I never gave them a chance before. Feels like, for once, I understand that dorky coward. <laughs> hmm, good. But anyway, he's not what's important. What matters now is the movie I'm shooting. Yeah. Right, yeah. Sounded like you were working on something big. 
It's a summer blockbuster with cutting edge CGI, or well, it was supposed to be, but now it feels like I'm missing something. I mean, sure, the dailies look great and all, but everything's so clean. There's just no tension, and the script's certainly not helping. Once I noticed all that, I couldn't ignore it. I don't know what to do. I feel like I should just quit the whole business. If I keep going, I'm stuck with a cast and crew that specializes in CGI. Nobody knows anything about practical effects or any traditional stunt work. Mm -hmm. But these fake explosions, the canned performances, they feel so cheap. I'm dying for real cinema, man. What do I do? <clears throat> huh. You know, you didn't strike me as someone who, with much integrity at first, but you do really love film. Hmm. Well, if my name's on something, I want it to be the best that it can be. Wow. That's a good thing. But hey, do you really still think Nathan's a coward? Nathan? Uh, I don't know. I guess I feel bad now about how I treated him. I have my own view of what movies could be like, and then he, when it didn't conform to that, I harassed him for it. And uh, that was a shitty thing to do. Yeah. Yeah, it was. It doesn't sound like you need me to tell you that it was wrong. When you can, you should go apologize to him. You know, I'm planning on it. Mm. So, practical effects and traditional stunt work, huh? Hmm. A little while ago, I wound up working with a director who was almost obsessive about realism. I got blown up and burnt, but the crew seemed to appreciate my performance. If James needs people with the right know-how, those guys could be perfect. <clears throat> Sup? If you need help on real explosions and stunts, I know some folks. Us? Huh? How do you know anybody? Are you in the industry? Not really, but I happen to be acquainted with a certain legendary filmmaker. Hmm. Uh, let's give him a call. Mm. All right, let's give that legend on the line. Boney, his name's Boney, I remember. Uh, Scoresman, thank you for a $2 super chat. It's actually Scoresman. And he says, howdy ho, little doodles, loving the stream tonight. Thank you, Scoresman, for the super chat. I'm glad you're enjoying the stream. All right, Boney Kashua. The director, Boney Kashua, he doesn't compromise on realism in his action. Of course. Boney. King Lunar, I am very interested in the re-release of the original Battlefront 1 and 2. I talked about it on the podcast today, so give it a look. There was a big segment about it. What the hell's going on? Hello, Kasuka-san? To what do I owe the pleasure? Hey. So, I'm with this other film director, and he's looking for someone who knows about true stunt work. Who better than Boney Kashua to help him, I figured. Would you mind giving him some advice? Did you say, Boney Kashua? Well, I normally say I'm too busy to help some rookie, but I am in your debt. Where can we meet? Thanks. Thank you. I really appreciate it. We're at a park just off Sunset Street. All right, let me get dressed. I'll be right there. Okay. Ahoy! Sorry to keep you waiting. Huh? Holy shit, you're really him. Boney Kashua, the stunt killer. Huh? What's that? Wait a minute. I know your face! James Taylor? Hmm? You know him? By reputation. We've never met before, but this boy's the man of the hour in film circles. He's a bigger celebrity than his stars. Director Kashua is the visionary behind the legendary vehicular stunts in Sway the Car 1 and 2. He's a genius. Hmm. I can't believe I'm standing face to face with you. Mm. Why would you have need of me though? When I hear James Taylor, I think flashy, top of the line CGI, not my style. Why would you ever go practical? I'll uh, I'll fill you in. To... <laughs> I see, I see. But what a funny little story. <laughs> mm? Hmm? No. Oh, uh, don't mind me. I'm simply happy to have skills that I can still pass down to the new generation. So, very well. If you're really serious, I'll show you how to craft a true action scene. Uh, yes, please, sir. Mm. Let's discuss the plot. What's happening? Uh -huh. Picture this. Hundreds of fucking semi-trucks combined to form a giant no-shit robot to protect the city. The key shot is the hero running through all these colliding semis to make it to the command room. Now, normally I just record the actor running in place and doing the rest digitally, but now I see the value of realism. Ah. My boy, you're making cinema. Not only have you enlisted the perfect advisor in myself, but you have the industry's premier stuntman standing before you. Hmm? Huh? I trust no one else to gracefully elude life-threatening traffic hazards than Kasuga-san. Whoa, seriously? You never told me that you were a stuntman. Wait, no. 
No! You don't want me to do one more stunt work, do you? Please, I can pay you generously. Won't you do it for cinema? Mm. Ugh. James is sure passionate about this. Of course I'm gonna do Got it. it. <clears throat> Fine. If this is so important to you in the film of art, or the art of film, excuse me, then I'll do my part. Excellent. Let's hop to it then. We'll shoot on Riverside Walk. We do will meet there later, or could I call my chauffeur to drive us over immediately? What would be the best? Uh, let's just do it now. We have about 10 minutes left, so let's just do it. Yeah. What the hell? Let's get it over with. I'll assemble the crew. All right. <sighs> May I say it? It's an honor to work with you again, Kasuga-san. <sighs> Honor's all mine, I guess. Although, those explosions last time were brutal. Well, you're running through a pathway of bombs loaded with kerosene and gunpowder. It had better be brutal. I'm sure you shed any t latent fears once you see the passion of our directors at work. That's fascinating. So, to keep the tempo dynamic, you delay the timing of the dolly intentionally and then start on a wide... Exactly. Constant speed and medium shots will bore the viewer. You have to sip stimulate the subconscious. Damn, they're really talking shop. I guess he's not just some old sadist after all. Of course not. Just think, these two brilliant creators from rival ends of the creative spectrum are collaborating at last. It'll make history. Oh. It's really that big of a deal? I suppose this isn't your average film set. <clears throat> Whoa. There you are, Kazuka-san. James and I have gone over most of the details, so we're ready for you. Okay. All right. What am I going to be doing? Dodging cars in a fancy suit again? Uh-huh. More or less, but this time you'll be dodging semis. Mm -hmm. What's that mean? Uh-huh. Picture this. Hundreds of fucking semi-trucks combining to perform a giant robot. All right. Yeah. This is about a bunch of trucks crashing into each other. Mm-hmm. And we've got a much higher budget to play with, so we lose far more explosives. Trucks will be flying to and fro non-stop. Brake lines cut. Oh, boy. Your character's in for some pain if he gets hit. So dodge them all unless you want to ruin the movie and have fun out there. <sighs> you know, somehow it's only starting to sink in what I signed up for. But remember, speed is crucial. If the camera sees you hesitate, the entire take's ruined. Got it. Yeah, I get it. Dodge the trucks, reach the finish line, do it fast, right? I knew you were a prodigy. Good luck, Kasuga-san. That's my guy. Ready to roll. Lights, camera, action. Yeah. Great. I'm gonna get clobbered, aren't I? <laughs> Let's make it happen. All right, here we go. We got three lives. What the? It actually didn't hit me. It legit didn't hit me. I was to the side of it. That didn't make any sense at all. Let's make it happen. Action! That was pretty lame. Oh crap! This is a lot harder. Thank you, Gabriel. I will try to enjoy my day off. This is hard. Let's make it happen. Action! There's probably a set pattern to follow to do it. And that's definitely not it. Well, we didn't do it. <sighs> Who's taking five? Waiting for you yeah. to regain consciousness. So we gotta do it again. And I have no health, but it doesn't matter. You're not gonna die. Okay. What happened? Huh? Let's do it again. Oh, they want me to heal? I think they want me to heal. It works. Ready. It, wor it works. Okay. Give me every truck you got. No. They said you can make it easier. You heard what they said? They'll make it easier for you so you can pass the mission. But I just wanna, I wanna try to do it legit. But man, it's hard. Let's make it happen. Action! It's fucking hard.
He turned. He changed direction. Did you see that? The truck changed direction. It was going straight and it veered and then it veered back. So I adjusted so it wouldn't hit me and then it went right back and hit me anyway. Oh man, this is this is way harder than the first one. What the hell? I don't even know how I could have avoided that one. Damn. Let's make it happen. Action. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, this is so hard. This is legitimately really hard. They aim for you, and you, if you slow down, you're done. You can't even run lane to lane. I'm trying to run lane yeah. to lane, and it's just too slow to really adjust, so you have to just always be running in the right direction. You can't even use your skills out of combat. No, you can't use healing skills out of combat, it looks like. Nope. Wow. Wow. Well, so much for my tuna salad sandwiches. Oh, I hit ease up. Totally. Oops. I, was, I wasn't paying attention. I didn't mean to do that. Well, now it's going to be easier. I didn't mean to do that. Let's make it happen. <clears throat> Action! Now it's way easier. Wow, now it's like significantly easier. Well, I didn't mean to do that. Obviously, I'm going to beat it now. <laughs> I didn't mean to make it this much easier. Don't. Yeah, now I'm going to get, like, no rewards because I didn't mean to do it. <clears throat> Right, it went from too hard to way too easy. This, this footage, it's unearthly. It's a masterpiece. Cut! Sensational, <laughs> sensational, Katsuga-san. I've never seen such realism in film or in life. <clears throat> That's nice. Hey, where's James at? I thought he was filming, right? I don't see him. Why, he's right there! Beside you the whole time! Huh? Oh! Jeez! No! You scared the shit out of me! I've borne witness. That was the apex of filmmaking. He must have felt this way the whole time. You were uh. by my side the entire shoot? Yes. God, yes! He insisted on capturing every frame himself, and now look at him. That, my colleagues, is the face of an uh. artist. I just checked out the raw footage, and it's sublime. The rumbling of the trucks, the fragrance of the diesel, it's all there. How I'm so humbled to have shot this. <laughs> well, I can see it meant a lot to you. I barely recognize the bully I met with Nathan way back when. Please, don't remind me of that. But you're right. Without him, I'd still be that same close-minded, egotistical, multi-award winning flash in the pan. I have to find a way to thank you. <laughs> I think you should communicate that through your movie. I'm sure Nathan would like it. Yeah. From now on, I'll pour my heart, my passion, and my regret into every scene for the rest of the shoot. Great. Good luck to you. I'm curious, how are you planning to use today's shot? Even with our practical effects, this won't pass for science fiction. Glad you asked. I'm going to use CGI, but only to alter the background and augment our real footage. Splendid. <laughs> you must let me see the final print when it's complete. Huh? What's gotten into you, director? After all this time, you're capitulating to James's use of special effects? Yeah. You literal moron! <laughs> I'm capitulating. 
amounting to nothing. I'll never abandon my pursuit of realism. That's it. I'm wise enough to know that verisimilitude alone does not entertain an audience. I've learned that James Taylor's chic cinematic sensibilities stand for something as well. Here you go. If I can master them too, I'll be unstoppable as a director. Yeah, that's awesome. Please, you have my invitation to review everything I do. I want all the advice you've got. <laughs> Sounds like you both found a way to grow from one another. See, we can underlay a backdrop here, no problem. But in a tight shot, <clears throat> we'll lose momentum. Indeed, the farther shot would be more appropriate, which would... Hey, what if an extra gets blown across the screen as we transition? <laughs> mm, that would certainly draw the eye. They're in their own world, it looks like. Guess that's how masters of an art form communicate. Mm-hmm. It's useless trying to stop them now. Oh, by the way, James gave me this. He said to consider it a bonus for nailing the shot. He asked me to hold on to it for you, just in case either of you blew up here today. Wonder if I'm getting too used to hearing about them talk about my death so casually. Anyway, here you are. It's, it's gonna be junk because again, I did the right? I did the Thank weaker you. version by accident. It's a rocket launcher yeah. item. To, it's a Thank disposable. You too. Well, guess I'll head out. Yep, it's junk. I certainly didn't need the rocket launcher. Okay, but the truck driver wailing as he flies headlong through the windshield? Post or practical? <laughs> I think that's one that calls for the magic of the set, Mr. Taylor. Oh, kasuga san Hmm? No! Would you mind getting into the driver's seat of that truck for a second? The seat the driver gets killed in? I'm asking you as well, boy. Don't worry. Nah. We've got loads of pillows and blankets for the pieces of you to land on. What is it with you when thinking pillows and blankets make it okay? No, I'm done. I'm leaving. No, oh, come on, please. We have a chance at making the perfect movie here. Please. <laughs> we need you. Okay, get this straight. I'm retiring from movies. Forever! Wait, hold on, Kasuga! Hoi, hoi, hoi. Polygon man, have a good night. Uh, sucks, the reward stunk. I did all that for what? For a disposable rocket launcher item that's worthless. All because I accidentally picked the wrong difficulty. I'm like, oh, man. Well, we did a lot of missions tonight, right? In fact, if you take a look, I'm pretty sure we did almost every mission on the western part. We didn't get to do the coffee one. We do have the final fight here, but I, I think I want to level up a little bit further before we do the final fight against the MMA guy. Um, as for other missions, there's a few. We still got uh, Embrace Your Wild Side. I don't even know what that is. We still got Sujimon, although I don't know if we'll do Sujimon. Yeah, I'm not sure. Over here we have... The guy who basically kept getting tricked by everyone. The simp, basically, right? We have his mission. We still have some dialogues. We still have to go back to Revolve. We have the upper right-hand corner of the map we didn't even go to yet, and I don't even know it's over there. So, and oh, we actually never even went to the Southern Beach either, right? So we actually do significantly still have a lot of stuff to do um, before we really have to focus on back, going back to the main story. So I think what we'll do... Why not get a free heal? Drinks later. Right? And, uh... <clears throat> I think it's time to save up, right? <clears throat> Alright. So. Good progress tonight. When we play again this weekend, likely we'll do very similar to tonight. We'll continue on with the side quests that are available to us. See if we can find any more mini-bosses. Um... And then maybe after another night of side questing, then we actually do an entire night of just main story progress, which would be neat too. But this is great. Now we're, we're utilizing everything, right? We're able to fight, win these really tough fights. We have absolutely nothing holding us back from doing these missions that we're finding. <clears throat> you know, no level caps or anything, or, or no no issue. So this is great. All right. I hope that you guys have enjoyed. I definitely enjoyed tonight. I'm looking forward to another chill night this week. I think this is next week coming up. There's two streams of this. 
Yeah, I think we're doing two streams next week, so we can maybe split it up. But good stuff, and thank you all, everyone. You were a great in interactive audience. For those who supported the stream tonight, thank you so very much. And I uh, can't wait to see you over the weekend for more Like a Dragon Infinite Well. Peace out, everyone. See you then. Bye-bye.